BYD is gearing up for a major leap in battery technology with the upcoming launch of its second-generation Blade battery, set to debut in the first half of 2025. The company is targeting a 15% cost reduction for this next-gen battery, signaling its commitment to making electric vehicles EV, more affordable while pushing the boundaries of battery performance. The new BYD Blade battery to point zero promises to improve upon the current version, which already has a solid reputation in the market for its unique, safety-focused design. The new Blade battery will offer a significant increase in energy density, up to 210 watt per kg, while still maintaining its core lithium iron phosphate (LFP) chemistry. In addition, the second-generation Blade battery will support an impressive 16C peak discharge rate, ensuring it can deliver high power output when needed. BYD will offer two formats of the blade battery to point zero, a short blade format and a long blade format. The short blade will have a lower energy density, offering 160 watt per kg, but will excel in terms of charging and discharging capabilities, boasting a maximum discharge rate of 16C and an 8C charge rate. In contrast, the long blade format with its higher energy density of 210 watt per kg, will feature an 8C discharge rate and a 3C charge rate, making it more suitable for applications that demand higher overall energy capacity, though with a slightly slower charging rate. To understand the significance of these specifications, it's important to look at the C rate, a measure of how quickly a battery can be charged or discharged in relation to its total capacity. For example, a 1C charge rate means a battery can be fully charged in one hour, while an 8C charge rate means it can be fully charged in just 7.5 minutes. Assuming constant power is applied, this rapid charging capability is especially attractive for consumers looking to minimize downtime during EV charging. While the new BYD Blade battery to point zero will offer a boost in energy density and performance, the company is also focusing on driving down costs. The cost reduction target of 15% for the higher energy density version is particularly noteworthy as it aligns with BYD's broader strategy of making its EV offerings more competitive in the ever-evolving EV market. Currently, the Blade battery's energy density stands at around 150 watt per kg, so this 15% reduction would mark a notable improvement in both performance and cost effectiveness. However, not all aspects of the new Blade battery will come at a lower cost. The lower energy density version, while offering faster charge and discharge rates due to reduced internal resistance, will likely be priced similarly to the current generation blade battery, or possibly slightly higher. This is due to the complexities associated with scaling up production of such advanced batteries, as well as the limited leverage BYD has over certain suppliers. Some critical components for the blade battery are sourced from a small number of manufacturers who hold significant control over pricing, making it difficult for BYD to negotiate lower prices for these parts. Hello and welcome to the Electric Explorer. Thank you for subscribing to our channel. We bring you the latest and hottest news on electric mobility every day. We're excited to introduce three membership levels, Circuit Squires, Tesla Knights, and Volt Sovereigns. Each level offers exclusive perks and content tailored for EV enthusiasts. Your support helps us deliver engaging video updates daily and keeps you connected to the EV community. Join us and be a part of the electric revolution. The price of batteries is a key factor in the overall cost structure of electric vehicles and the ongoing battery price war has become one of the most competitive aspects of the EV industry. BYD faces mounting pressure from competitors like Cattle, which has slashed the price of its VDA spec LFP batteries from 0.9 yuan per watt two years ago to just 0.35 yuan per watt today. These more affordable batteries are often intended for entry-level EV, but they are part of a larger trend, where LFP batteries are increasingly being used to challenge the dominance of more expensive nickel-manganese cobalt and MC batteries in higher-end electric vehicles. As the global EV battery market heats up, BYD is positioning itself as a strong competitor, especially in the premium LFP battery space. While Cattle has made significant strides in producing high-quality LFP batteries at lower prices, BYD is working to push its LFP offerings into the premium market, where performance can rival that of NMC batteries, but at a more affordable price point. This strategic move is important as automakers increasingly look to reduce the cost of their EV without sacrificing performance. Industry analysts predict that the prices of EV batteries will continue to fall, with a near 50% drop expected by 2026. Goldman Sachs Research GSR, has forecasted a reduction in average battery prices, 
which fell from $153 per kWh in 2022 to $149 per kWh in 2023. By the end of this year, prices are expected to dip further to $111 per kWh, with projections suggesting they will reach $80 per kWh by 2026. This dramatic price decline is expected to make electric vehicles even more accessible to consumers, further accelerating the shift toward electrification. While much attention has been focused on the EV automaker price war, it's clear that the battle among battery manufacturers is even more intense. Suppliers are constantly renegotiating prices, and those that can offer high-quality, cost-effective batteries will have a significant advantage in the EV market. This has become particularly important as automakers look to secure long-term battery supply agreements to meet their EV production goals. In terms of market share, BYD remains a strong contender, having installed 100.66 gigawatt hour VV batteries in 2024, marking a 19.4% increase from the previous year. However, its share of the Chinese market stands at 24.4%, significantly behind cattle, which leads with 46.2% market share. Despite this, BYD has focused on LFP batteries, which now make up the vast majority of its battery sales. The company installed just 0.16 GWH of NMC batteries in 2024, demonstrating its commitment to LFP technology. As the EV battery landscape continues to evolve, BYD's second-generation blade battery represents a significant step forward, promising to enhance the performance of electric vehicles while helping to lower costs. The competition between BYD and other major battery suppliers like cattle is expected to intensify as the market for electric vehicles continues to expand, driving innovation and cost reductions in the years to come.